Today's video market update is a reference to the city of Norfolk. If you're a buyer or a seller, this is great information that will certainly keep you updated on what's going on in that city. Let's get right to the video. All right, let's get right to the data for the city of Norfolk, Virginia, September 2023, as compared to September of 2022, median sales price, 295000 And you can see it is a 7.3% increase over last year, where it was 275000 So it's a $20,000 median sales price increase for Norfolk. Um, but uh, I don't know, we're starting to trend a little bit on the other side of that. Uh, is that interest rates? It could be. It could definitely be interest rates. Settled sales, 241. That is down 22.3% from 310 last September. And uh, and it continues to decre decrease versus August where it was 270. So 241 closed transactions. Median uh, days on market, 16 days on market. And that's that's still a strong seller's market. Uh, it's down 11.1%. It was 18 days last September. Um, but you can see right here in August, it was uh, 14 days. So 16 days, still a seller's market, still a seller's market. You are getting as a seller uh, pretty much full price. If you price the proper property properly, uh, you're still getting full price. Median sold dollar per square foot, $195. Uh, that's pretty much uh, going hand in hand with our median sales price. New listings on the market, 333. That's down 9% uh, from last September where it was 366 uh, new listings. And you can see it's pretty much just hanging right in there for the last 12 months. Active inventory, uh, 1% down active inventory last uh, last September was 528. Now we're at 523. Uh, month supply of inventory. This number creeping up a little bit. 2.2. Uh, we haven't seen uh, the twos since last January. You can see last year, uh, September was 1.7. So 2.2. This number normally uh, probably in that 4 to 6 range. So still in a little bit of a seller's market. Maybe not as strong as it was a year ago. And uh, what this means is if everything else remained the same, uh, how long would it take to liquidate our current inventory in the city of Norfolk? 2.2 months is what that means. So as a buyer, it's still a competition out there. You still need to make sure you're writing a solid offer. I would strongly recommend that you use a realtor to represent you in a buyer broker uh, relationship. If you're a seller, you still need to be saving your money, saving your equity. You should check us out. R E D E F Y flat fee.com redefy flat fee.com. We are a flat fee company. We list homes 100% full service, including photography at a flat fee. Uh, $5,500 is our commission. There's a $300 setup fee and that's it. 5,800 bucks on the listing side. And so uh, compare that to a, a firm that lists your property at 3%, let's say $700,000 sale. That's $21,000 of real estate commission while here we're at 5,800 total. Uh, check us out, R-E-D-E-F-Y flatfee.com. Please be sure to check out our other videos of uh, Virginia Beach and Chesapeake. We're going to be back next month looking at October. Make it a great day. Stay safe out there.